Hi, I'm Gat Camper and I run a wood furniture factory in Berkeley Springs, West Virginia called Cat Creek. We manufacture uh, solid wood furniture made from Appalachian hardwoods, primarily coming out of West Virginia. Uh, everything we build is really built by hand, signed and dated by the person who built it and shipped you know, throughout the country and in fact throughout the world. So one of the, you know, we've been an industry that's been through a lot of transition. At the beginning of the century, in 2000, 90% uh, of the wood furniture that was consumed in the United States was made in the United States. Um, today that number is 10%. It's totally flip-flop from where it was. Uh, we happen to be one of the companies that are lucky enough to have survived such an onslaught. And uh, one of the reasons we've been able to survive is we've been able to consistently reinvest in this company. Uh, we uh, kind of talk about being handmade furniture, but uh, you know, equipment, uh, processes, computers are just critical to us being competitive. We have to compete on a worldwide basis and we really can't do that with the, without being able to invest in stuff like CNC technology, it's essentially equivalent to digital printing that's doing incredible amounts of manufacturing, making our people incredibly uh, productive. Um, today, uh, you know, in business, capital is just so critical. You need capital like that. Capital makes people more productive. It uh, gives you the ability to make good jobs into great jobs and okay jobs into good jobs. Uh, there was a slogan years ago that says, you know, what creates change? Capital creates change. You know, bringing capital in this business and bringing capital investment into West Virginia is really the, is really the key for future growth and future good jobs in this organization. Today, unfortunately, the state, uh, our state, you know, taxes capital in the form of inventory, equipment, uh, inside factories like ours. Um, most states don't do this, and uh, it's a grand mistake. It's a very competitive world, and we compete with capital, and we compete for capital. Um, you know, really one of the things I'm hoping would like to impress on folks is that we really need to open up the state and invite that capital in. And companies like ours have them to give them the ability and the incentive to bring capital in and uh, you know, reinvest in their companies to make uh, their manufacturing uh, more efficient, make their manufacturing more competitive because most of us compete on a worldwide basis, and make their employees the jobs better jobs and more productive jobs.